Hello my friends, this is Eric Merida Daz 3D and in this video we're going to talk about the My Stuff tab. Now the My Stuff tab lives in the Actors Wardrobe and Props activity and it is split up into two different ways of looking at files. We've got the Products view which has files grouped into products and we have the individual files that we can search through. And in this video we're going to talk about just the Files view. Let's start off by talking about metadata. Now metadata is information about files. Now if you look down here and click open this uh, info tab, you'll see that we have information about the file. The file's name, when it's created, modified, and we can look through any file and see that information. But there's a bunch of uh, information that is not shown in the info tab and it's shown, it, it's stored in our database and it shows up when we start looking at relationships between files. If you click on any one of these, let's do this, let's click on this and or right click on it and you'll say browse other files that work with this. You'll see that it, it knows about relationships um, like this file helps customize Genesis or is customized by, here's a bunch of material presets that change the color of the hair. So it knows what customizes it and what it helps customize. So relationships in both directions. And that's an amazing and a powerful thing that shows up when we select something in the scene. Now watch this list right here as I select on this figure. Boom! So this list shortens and only shows us our content that works with this figure. Nothing else. Click off it again, it lengthens, it shows us things like sets, um, and scenes. When you click on this, that stuff's ir irrelevant. It won't work. It won't load onto the figure, so it takes it away. Now let's compare this workflow with content library of old. Um, and let's go all the way back here to where you would normally start out. Now let's say I wanted to, let's click on wardrobe. Let's say I wanted to find this jacket here. I would have to go in and know, know where it's at. I know it's a Death Studio format. I know it's in my library. Everything is. Uh, people, Genesis, clothing, Magus, and there's the jacket. Now that wasn't too difficult, but I knew where it was at. Can you imagine if you didn't know where your content got installed? Many of you can't imagine that because it's happened to you many times and it's frustrating not to know where your content is. Well that whole process goes away once we have metadata for all our content. All right, so let's just show um, this metadata system and my stuff in action. So let's load some items. And I'm going to probably speed through these and, and compress this video so you're not waiting. All right, so here's the character. Now I'm going to open up the scene tab. Um, so I have quick selection here via the list. And let's uh, click on all. And I'm just going to select, I'm going to go through these and we're going to update. Um, we're going to change some stuff and just show you how fast this can be. Megas collar. Let's make that the, well, let's make that the red since it's already gold. We'll go to the shorts. Let's make those red. Let's go to the leggings. We'll make those uh, this mesh. We'll go to the boots and we'll make those red as well. And we'll go to the jacket and we'll turn that into maybe this one. All right, so we've changed it quite a bit. Now let's grab the Genesis figure um, again and let's go to uh, presets and we see that we've got some, we've got a nude simple map there. So now that there's clothing over the top there, let's just change that so you see the skin underneath the clothing. And so we've just revamped our figure quite speedily, if I do say so myself. Something that we could not do this fast previously. And it's just so powerful that I can't imagine anybody not loving this. So anyway, that's the My Stuff tab. Hope you enjoy it.